So for this discussion post, I decided to focus on two apps that dealt with mental health. Uh, the first app is called Mood Path, and essentially it deals with uh, tracking your emotional health over the course of uh, two weeks. Um, you, When you log on, it asks you questions in the morning, noon, at night, uh, and it, it tracks your responses over the course of two weeks. Um, there's also um, videos and uh, reading material that you can look at that will um, get, help inform you and give you information about um, how to handle certain things like um, depression or anxiety and um, overall I think that it was um, very informative and um, I think that was definitely pro is that it was it was just so uh, informative and gave me a lot more information and it was really designed well um, the only con is that there were some things that you had to pay for which, uh, and, I mean, in our society today, it kind of all depends on money. Um, the other app that I used was uh, Headspace, and that was also um, an app that dealt uh, more along the lines of mental health. Um, they uh, had various tabs where you can, like, um, listen and watch um, um, meditations about... Um, you know, dealing with stress, dealing with anxiety, um, work stress, stuff like that. So um, there were a lot of different um, areas where you could where you could go to and uh, learn and uh, learn how to like deal with your your stress about certain things. Um, again, the only con is that um, they also made you pay for certain like certain things on the app. Um, I think that both apps, um, can benefit, um, college students. I know I have in the past, uh, had a lot of stress and anxiety, um, about, you know, classes and, and the workload that, that we're under. So I think, I think that these two apps can definitely benefit them. And, um, you know, this, these, these two apps kind of reminded me of what Chaco was talking about in, uh, chapter eight of our book. Um, about how um, we in in our in our society today we we really want to take our our own health into our in our into our own hands, and um, these these were two examples of that, and um, I think that they're really important, and um, I think that going forward I'll probably continue to use them because it's it's important to to you know keep track of your own health, especially your mental health.